quick guide on how to bridge our Converge router. Please take note on the following requirements. Our third pointer router is connected to the LAN 1 of our Converge. And we're connected to the third party router using LAN or Wi Fi. Now, I will demonstrate why we need to bridge. I will be trace routing to Cloudflare. And as you can see on the results, I have number 1, 2, and 3 are routers. Now, this effectively makes a triple NAT. Now, the goal is to eliminate the third one, which is a converge, and that will be through bridging. Because double NAT or triple NAT will cause some issues in online game. So we have to log in to our converge portal at 192.168.100.1. So again, the passwords or super admin passwords should be in the backspace discord under admin access section. So after we logged in, go to advanced, maintenance, diagnosis, and configuration. Now click download configuration file. This will allow us to revert back any changes if we actually mess up. After this, you may notice that I have tested only on Huawei EG81 for 5v5. So up next, we have to disable our Wi-Fi on our Converge router. So just uncheck Enable WLAN for 2.4G and 5GHz. Now go to LAN Layer 2 Port Configuration and check LAN 1. And finally, go to the one configuration. We have to take note of the existing configuration here because we will be doing the same. We'll just change the one mode and service type. After you have taken notes, we will proceed in bridging. So basically, we will be changing one mode to bridge and service type to internet while keeping the other configuration the same. So let's proceed in deleting configuration. Now click new and set the one mode to bridge one service type internet. The villain ID as before is 10. Check the binding LAN1 and the encapsulation mode to IPOE. Protocol IPv4. There is no IPv6 in Converge. Once you have confirmed, click apply settings. Now we have to log in to our third party routers portal and confirm if the IP address has changed. Now again, the previous IP address is 192.168.100.22 and I will be clicking refresh the DHCP list and we shall get a class A private IP address. And as you can see, I have the class a private address which is 10.230 something this confirms that we have successfully bridged our router and i will be doing a trace route to confirm and as you can see the converge ip address of the router is now missing it's a comparison on what it looks like after bridging so we have eliminated the double NAT problem by bridging our router and there should be no significant changes on your speed. If you notice, you will also lose access to the Converge dashboard. So if you want to get access to it, you have to set a static IP on your computer. Just set it to static IPv4 
192.168.100.2 and the gateway 192.168.100.1 and you should be able to access back to the Converge dashboard. Now this video is a bit late because I believe Converge is deploying Wi-Fi 6 routers. I am not sure on what the dashboard looks like. Thank you for watching. Click share, like, and subscribe because a lot of you are not subscribed yet. Until next time.